നമസ്കാർ വെൽക്കം ടു ഇന്ത്യ മെട്രോളജിക്കൽ ഡിപ്പാർട്ട്മെൻറ്റ്സ് ഡെയിലി വെതർ ബ്രീഫിംഗ് പ്രോഗ്രാം മൈ സെൽഫ് ഡോക്ടർ എം ടി ബുഷേർ ടുഡേ തേർട്ടി വൺ ജൂലൈ ടു തൗസൻഡ് ട്വൻറ്റി ഫോർ ഇൻ ദിസ് പ്രസൻറ്റേഷൻ ഐ വിൽ ബി ഡിസ്കസിംഗ് അബൌട്ട് ദി പാസ്റ്റ് ട്വൻറ്റി ഫോർ അവർ വെതർ ഒബ്സേർവ്ഡ് ആൻഡ് അബൌട്ട് ദി വെതർ ദാറ്റ് വി ആർ എക്സ്പെക്ടിംഗ് നെക്സ്റ്റ് ഫൈവ് ഡേയ്സ് ഫസ്റ്റ് ലെറ്റ്സ് ലുക്ക് ടു ദ വെതർ ഒബ്സേർവ്ഡ് so uh, if we if we look into the uh, observed map we can see that the maximum rainfall was observed over the south interior karnataka that is extremely heavy rainfall that is great rainfall greater than 20 cm has been observed from the south interior karnataka and over the entire western ghats region kerala coastal karnataka uh, kongan goa madhya maharashtra uh, gujarat region and also over chatis uh, chatisgarh uh, assam meghalaya and uttarakhand these regions uh, very heavy rainfall was you know so that is rainfall from 11 cm centimeter to 20 centimeter and the region marked with the yellow yellow shading has been received a heavy rainfall that is rainfall between uh, 7 to 11 centimeter the uh, significant rainfall amount is marked here over uh, shivamogga district 21 cm dakshin kannada 19 cm raigad 15 cm north goa 14 cm korba 14 cm surat 13 cm kasaragod 13 cm and kolapur 12 cm rainfall this is only significant amount of rainfall now let's look into the uh, today's position of the monsoon trough so monsoon trough as of today it is passing very uh, close to its normal position that is from uh, sri ganga nagar hisar then to delhi and our hardoi and dehri and to purlia and sagar island then to the uh, bay of bengal and now let's look into the position uh, today's synoptic system that observed by uh, 3 utc that is 8:30 hours morning so the there was a cyclonic circulation uh, seen over the uh, jharkhand and neighborhood on yesterday as of today that system has seen over the gangetic west bengal and neighborhood and it and its circulation extending up to 5.8 km above mean sea level and another cyclonic circulation seen over the south assam and neighborhood and one cyclonic circulation seen over the uh, north arabian sea arabian sea and the shear zone now passes through the 20 degree north and uh, uh, offshore trough also seen from the south gujarat to kerala coast under the influence of this system we are uh, expecting activities mainly over the central and northwest region northwest india and also over the west coast regions so today's highlights is isolated heavy to very heavy rainfall likely to continue along west coast india uh, widespread rainfall with isolated heavy to very heavy rainfall likely over northwest central and east india during next 3 to 4 days now coming to the warnings issued for today uh this is a warning issued for today we can see that over the uh, regions which are highlighted with red that is our uttarakhand we are expecting it is likely to get a very heavy rainfall but last few days uttarakhand is receiving uh, very heavy rainfall so those, uh, we are issuing red warning for those regions and the other regions like uh, and their northwest india uh, himachal pradesh uttarakhand delhi punjab and uh, uttar pradesh uh, east rajasthan uh, east mp chatisgarh vidarbha and other west coast regions starting from the uh, kongan goa to uh, kerala tamil nadu uh, we are expecting very heavy rainfall uh, that is rainfall between uh, uh, 12 cm to 12 cm uh, 20 cm and the regions which highlighted with the yellow yellow shaded regions we are expecting heavy rainfall that is we, if we see it is uh, west rajasthan jammu kashmir west 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 madhya pradesh odisha uh, jharkhand gangetic west bengal assam meghalaya it is likely to get uh, heavy rainfall coming to the day to forecast day to forecast also we are expecting um, very heavy rainfall over the entire central india and uh, northwest india plains of the north plains of the northwest india and the mmmt mainly over the mizoram regions and over the western ghats regions and a very a heavy rainfall we are expecting over kerala tamil nadu uh, rajasthan uttar uh, jammu and kashmir and also over the assam meghalaya and uh, gangetic west uh, sub himalayan west bengal and sikkim 
coming to the day three, uh, day three forecast that is valid for 2nd August. So very heavy rainfall is likely to occur Madhya Pradesh, Chhattisgarh, Vidarbha and the Western Ghats regions and Kerala and Kerala, uh, North India, Karnataka, Odisha, uh, Odisha and uh, Gangetic West Bengal, uh, Charkhand, uh, Uttar Pradesh and, and their Northeast regions likely to get uh, heavy rainfall. And coming to the day 4 forecast that is valid for 3rd August, uh, Gujarat and their Gujarat and uh, Costa Karnataka, uh, Kongan and Goa and Madhya Maharashtra and Madhya Pradesh and their Madhya Pradesh and Uttarakhand likely to get very heavy rainfall and the regions marked with the yellow yellow likely to get heavy rainfall that includes in their uh, northeast regions um, uh, sabimal and west bengal and sikkim bihar uttar pradesh uh, chhattisgarh and vidarbha and uh, uh, Madh and uh, uh, marathwada and uh, coastal karnataka and uh, uh, south interior karnataka coming to the day five forecast uh, very heavy rainfall likely to get over the coastal regions of uh, uh, western coast region including uh, Gujarat region, um, Kongan Goa and uh, Madhya Maharashtra and the regions highlighted with the yellow color likely to get uh, heavy rainfall that is rainfall between uh, 7 cm to 11 12 cm. Coming to the fisherman warning is issued for next 5 days. Over the marked regions fishermen are not advised to go to for venturing. So, uh, this is for day one and this is for day two this is for day three and day four and day five so over the market region our fishermen are advised not to do any venture imd's forecast and warnings are available in social media platforms we request public to be updated with imd's forecast and warning we will come tomorrow with the latest warnings till then namaskar <music>